Hi guys, this is Demurat from mgstuts.com where you can find useful materials about CNC and laser machines and their softwares. From this particular tutorial, I'm beginning a series of tutorials about Victric Aspire soft. This is the very simple, easy to use software to prepare your designs to cut in CNC machines. In this tutorial, I'll start from Vector Aspire 9 interface. Vector Aspire has simple designed interface that combines all tools in one place. After the first launch, you will see empty working space as you didn't create any model. At the left side, you can see some panel where you can find different links and some buttons. Let's click on new file button to create new file after clicking you will see model on the right side and on the left side you will see some panel where you need to enter some newly created model parameters this is the only preview and until you will not click on the create button it will not create it let's see what you can find on this panel in the first section you need to set what type of work you will create one-sided work or double-sided. I'm gonna create one-sided design, that's why I'm setting one side job and let's switch to second section and here you can set model dimensions and units that you will use. I'm going to set the units to millimeters and set the size of the model here. If while I'm working I'll need to change size of the model, I will able to do that easily. In this section you can also set the thickness of the material that you will use. Next I need to set Z0 position. This will be useful when you will cut your material on the CNC. I will not go deep into this option as you are just starting to learn this software. Most frequently you will use Z0 position at the material surface. And the next XY datum position section you need to set origin point of the working space this option also affecting on the CNC and that's why I'll go deep into these options later I'm going to set it to the bottom left corner at last you need to set resolution and the color of the 3D objects I'm clicking OK to create a new document as you can see Aspire interface looks simple it's look like Artcom older interface and structured in same way. Let's check it out how this interface structured. As in all software, at the top you can see main menu where you can find all features of this software. At the left side you can find all tools to design and modify designed objects. You can switch between group of tools by tabs at the bottom of the left corner. This panel can be detached and attached to the right side or simply can be flow. You can set it any way that you like. If you will click on a small icon at the top right corner of the panel, you can switch between design panel and the toolpath panel where you can find different machining tools. Now let's check top side of the working space. As you can see, here we can see two tabs that switch in between 2D view and 3D view and the right you can see layers where you can manage layers and the last on the right you can find many different navigation and view tools that can help you while you are designing. So as you can see Vector has a very simple interface. This was the just beginning and from the next video tutorial we will start design and create many different things and you will learn how to work in the Vector Aspire. Well, this is all for this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel to get more useful materials about CNC and laser machine software. And also visit mgtoots.com and visit our CNC and laser machine education school.